welcome back. The work week is over, so we are heading out to go camping this weekend at Deer Run RV Resort in Crossville, Tennessee. We're on our way to our campsite. This weekend we're staying across the lake. It's really where we normally stay. They have another section that houses their seasonal campers, people that own lots that stay here year round. I believe they said they had about 200 acres out here at Deer Run. It's one of our favorite campgrounds. During the summertime we bring our kayaks out kayak on the lake out here. It's really nice. It's supposed to be about 80 degrees this weekend, but we're going to let it warm up a little bit before we get the kayaks out. Let the water warm up. hard spot to get. It's always booked. This weekend we're staying in 302. Up the hill here is mainly like where the people rent like monthly. They stay up in here. It's 
excited to be here. Let's see if he can get it on the first try. He is very much a perfectionist when it comes to having the camper where he wants it. What do you think? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, let's not for the second time. Oh yeah. Let's not chase a snouser this weekend. We think. We can come on back. Looks I mean, looks pretty good to me. Yep, set her up. camping at Deer Run in Crossville, Tennessee. Um, this is actually one of our favorite places to camp at. Um, actually, it's the first place we ever camped. Whenever we got our first camper, this is actually our second camper that we've had and mm -hmm. owned since we've been married. Um, they recently got new owners, so it's, we actually met them for the first time this weekend. They were really nice. It uh, sounds like they're going to be doing some upgrades. Yep, 50 more campsites they're adding over by the lake and the bathhouse mm -hmm. up against the woods. Mm -hmm. If you've been out here before, it's where they used to have tent camping and still do a little bit of tent camping. I think they're going to add them in to right there, but 50 yeah. more campsites. And this week they're just going to start upgrading the beach area. So that's be nice. Mm -hmm. They put some new log 
swing log looking swings, swings yeah. around the lake at different spots. Yeah, those are really nice looking. They're pretty nice too. Yeah, where they're going to be putting the campsites. Also, that's where they had the Halloween. Yeah, where they had the, uh, what do you call that? The haunted Halloween. Haunted forest, haunted I forest, guess. Yeah. yeah, where they have that every year. It looks like that's where they're going to be putting the new campgrounds. Yeah. Um, they have a really big Halloween festival every yeah, year. Two weekend mm -hmm. deal. Yeah, it always falls around Ethan's fall break, so we try to take a week, and that's what we did last year. We took mm -hmm. a week and came out here and stayed, and it's really nice and really fun. The kids dress up and go around trick-or-treating. They do, like, crafts and pumpkin decorating and carving and stuff, too, as well. And you won. Yeah. Won a pumpkin contest, pumpkin carving decorating contest yeah. last year. Yeah, I won <laughs> first place last year. So, spent enough time on it. Maybe we can find a picture to put in to show my pumpkin that I did last year. Yeah. Um, of course, they also do like a big 4th of July thing where they shoot fireworks every year. Mm -hmm. It's a really know. nice show. Mm -hmm. You can get your chair and go out here on the dam and everybody sits on along the dam and then they go on the other side of the lake or whatever and mm -hmm. shoot off all kinds of fireworks mm -hmm. it's a really big fireworks show yes i hope they'll continue that you know this year as well so with the new owners i think they will yeah i would say they'll they'll follow those traditions in that form because that just brings more people in for sure mm -hmm. there's two sides to the campground we're on the section it's got like the 300s and all that mm -hmm. and we like staying up against the woods and those like 300 through three something i don't know 15 they're all really good campsites all all their campsites around here are full hookup 30 and 50 amp mm -hmm. they got cable uh of course they got water sewer electric obviously yeah and all of their sites and they're all real roomy yes they're, you're not stacked on each other like you are at a lot of campgrounds you've got room to spread out and you can room for two or three vehicles if you need to or whatever and you're not on top of your neighbor you can get out and build your fire without burning their camper down <laughs> so there's not a bad site at this campground no no so we're really hoping the the new ownership and is going to you know fill in the the shoes of the previous owners because they were really great but they seemed really nice so far yeah but we really we really love it here like i said this is our our favorite it's our favorite campground for sure by far um, I don't think we've found one that's really close. We enjoy, of course, going like Fall Creek Falls and stuff yeah. as well. Um, but as far as like private campgrounds, this, this one definitely, definitely is number, number one, one. Yeah. <laughs> for sure. Yeah. We'll we'll put in a tour. You know, we actually rented a golf cart this weekend too, and we'll put in a tour of of the campground. Yeah, and it's, it's got big. the They got a chapel out here. Mm -hmm. We'll put that in there with it and show you some of the permanent like the lot owners will show you some of their sites mm -hmm. and stuff like that but yeah and of course dogs are dogs are allowed mm -hmm. definitely our pooches love to go camping yep and they like golf golf carton too yeah yeah for sure well if you've been enjoying our videos, make sure to like and make sure you subscribe so you'll know when we put up new videos. The weather's getting warmer, so we're hoping that we'll be getting to camp more as the weather warms up. It was about 80 degrees this weekend, so we really enjoyed it. Yep. It's been a nice weekend. been windy, though. Yeah. <laughs> windy, but, you know, with it being 80 degrees, that was actually pretty, been pretty nice. Mm hmm Other than trying to, wanting to start a campfire. Yeah. So, all right, well, let's jump on the golf cart and take a tour.